us how to say where we are. We are at the Columba Jazz Center. And so you, it seems like you can kind of say it anyway. Is that yeah, what you're yeah. <laughs> you know, it uh, can be a tricky one. So our our tagline is any any way you want to pronounce it is fine by us. So Columba Columba Jazz Center. Columba Jazz. Columba Jazz. Yeah. Cool. Jazz. And it is way more than jazz hands. Yeah. <laughs> and so tell us what you guys have because it is more than jazz. Yeah, absolutely. Well, our organization, Columba Jazz, was founded in 1975. So we're uh, almost going to be celebrating our 50 year anniversary pretty soon. And we've been in this venue, the Columba Jazz Center, since the late 70s. And we are a nonprofit organization that presents concerts year round and provides music education programs. So we are primarily a jazz venue, but we present all kinds of music, you know, folk music, world music, blues, soul, and lots of jazz, of course. That's awesome. And so are you guys having performances weekly, monthly? Like how frequent can people come? Yeah, so we, um, we have performances every week. Um, I mean, obviously with the closure, you know, some shows have been getting canceled, but we do have weekly programming. Um, usually two shows a week, Mondays and Thursdays are our Columba Jazz Nights, and we also rent the facility for other local presenters on the weekends. Awesome. Mm -hmm. So there's always something happening Always something here. going on, yeah. Absolutely. And I think I heard something about if you're a student, there's something special around that too. Right? Yeah, yeah. We have um, a student ticket program, so we do offer half-price student tickets for every single Columba Jazz show. Yeah, and that's one thing that makes Columba really unique is that we're an all-ages venue, so it's um, you know a great place for families and for uh, you know if there are young music fans who want to get exposed to jazz, this is the place to do it. Yeah, yeah that's amazing because what more beautiful opportunity than to put music into the youth as well and have them experience that energy and that vibrancy that they're going to feel. Yeah. Sitting in the space with all ages of mm -hmm. people as well. Absolutely. Right? I mean, music is a life changing force, and not mm -hmm. only do we at Columba Jazz, you know, love being able to present incredible artists and bring them to the community, uh, it's really kind of boils down to music education mm -hmm. and, um, you know, furthering the legacy of jazz and that happens not just on the stage, but in classrooms and um, in all the various forms that our music education programs take. And that's from artists in the schools. We have um, clinicians and teachers going into local public schools to mm -hmm. talk about jazz and, and um, play, play jazz with students. And we have a master class series and cool. yeah. Wow. Which is both in person and virtual. Wow, yeah. that's great. Yeah. Man, I'm so excited actually to hear about that because yeah. I've got three kids and I'm like, I gotta get them yeah. to yeah. music. Yeah. Yeah. That's Master amazing. Master classes, we have an annual summer jazz camp and oh. honor band. Mm -hmm. Wow, oh cool. Okay, so I see that there's little tables around and so when people come for music, is there also things like any snacks or beverages? Stuff like that available? Yeah, absolutely. Um, we have a, a bar with beer and wine, local beers and wines, and we have our cafe and our longtime chef, Cheryl Simons. She um, puts together incredible locally sourced uh, meals. She does a dinner special for every Columba concert, and it, it, it changes for every show. So, mm -hmm. yeah, the, the food and the drink is, is fantastic. That's awesome. So you can like actually get a meal while you're mm -hmm. here. Oh yeah, Oh absolutely. my gosh, that's yeah. good. So it's like a whole night out or oh, afternoon, yeah. whatever the show mm -hmm. is. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. Um, so where can people find out more about when, when events are happening, all that information? What's the best place for resource for them to go to? Sure, um, well, you can find us on any social media platform, Kuomba Jazz, it's K-U-U-M-B-W-A. Uh, again, you know, or just Google us. Yeah. If you get the spelling close, it, it'll come up. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, KuomaJazz.org, social media, follow us there. Instagram um, is, a, is a great 
place to learn about our upcoming uh, events and concerts. And yeah, we we are we have an amazing lineup of concerts coming here this spring and mm -hmm. and throughout the rest of the year. So check us out, and we we hope you'll come see us. And so, is there? Thank you for sharing all of that because that's go check it out, you guys. This is super exciting. I can't wait for the year ahead to come myself. And is there anything else that you think is really important that you would love for our community to know about you guys? Just that. Um, we're a nonprofit organization and we are here for the community and also because of the community, the, the support that we get through, um, through our ticket sales for concerts, but also through our memberships and donations that help keep our music education programs going strong. That's, that's, what, that's what keeps us going and that's why we've, we've uh, been here for almost 50 years, so wow. we do want to thank the community for sticking with us. Wow, well thank you guys, thank you Ben and Chanel, and so that's this week on Discover Downtown, and we will see you guys next